What is up everybody? I hope you guys are doing well today. In today's video, I'm gonna be teaching you guys, showing you guys how to make one of these uh, LiPo balance lead cables for your GoPro bones. Um, the GoPro bone ships with a cable that looks similar to this one. Uh, I believe this one actually is the exact cable. I got this one online. Um, but if you don't want to solder your uh, your GoPro Bones cable into your flight controller, uh, there is an alternative. You can use your balance lead on your battery. So let me show you guys real quick. So here is uh, my quad, uh, GoPro Bones on the front. And you can use your little balance lead, as you guys can see, your little balance lead, plug this into the, into the uh, balance lead and then it'll power the GoPro. So. It's a little, uh, I, I like this setup better than soldering it directly into the, uh, into the flight controller. So, so that's what I'm going to show you guys today. Um, got some good angles for you guys. So the essentials, the things that you need in order to do this project, you're going to need this, uh, little cable right here from iFlight. Let me go ahead and, um, open this. I'm gonna move this to the side so you guys don't get confused put this one over there too. So uh, I'm gonna leave a link in the description to all of the things that you need to do this little project. Now listen, I'm no professional at soldering. This is literally my like second time soldering. So um, bear with me here. So this basically is the uh, balance lead and it can power your GoPro. But I tried to do this with my um, GoPro Hero 11 Black and it was not working, it did not work. It said not enough power or whatever, so um, I think it works with like the 10 and under, but at least the 11, it didn't work. But these cables are, I believe, $18 for a set of two, which is kind of up there, but hey, you get what you pay for. It has like some, uh, like a, I don't know if that's a fuse, but it has like a little motherboard right here. I don't know what all this is, but it looks pretty good. So we'll go ahead and start. First things first, you're gonna have to cut this little thing off right there. See you later, bud. And then you're gonna have to strip uh, just like a little bit. You can use your nails. It doesn't have to be, you know, nothing crazy. So go ahead and uh, strip the wires like that. And then we'll put those to the side. So now you have your little two sets right here. And then we'll focus on this one. So these two, obviously you're basically gonna just solder these two like this. Now you could probably go ahead and do this with having the yellow wire right here and put like some electrical tape on it. But personally, I like to remove the yellow wire, which isn't too uh, big of an issue. So what we're gonna do is be very careful, obviously. Um, I'm using a little X-Acto blade. You're basically gonna lift the tab let me see if I can do this. Let me adjust this camera. So you're basically going to lift this little tab right here. There's like a very small tab. If I can get under it. There we go. So once you lift it, you can pull the yellow. Oops. Just had it. Yep. So grab yellow. And then you should be able to pull it right out just like that. And then I'm going to put this up so I don't cut myself. And just like that, you remove the yellow little wire right here. So you're going to toss this away or do whatever you want with it. And basically, last but not least, you're just going to be soldering these two together. Now, I highly recommend uh, these little... Let me show you guys. So this stuff right here, FunTac mounting putty, highly recommend this, helps out. I forgot to mention, you are going to need um, some of this, what is this? I don't even know what this is called. Some uh, heat shrink tube. So I got this off Amazon. Like I said, I'll leave this in the description. So before you start soldering, make sure to put your heat shrink tubing over the part that you're going to solder because obviously you're not going to be able to put it on. 
So put this over it. I can do this, jeez. Just like that. And then you're gonna want to line up your wires. So I like to leave a little gap so I can have room to work with. Oops, that's too low. That works, sure. Okay. And we'll put this one right here. Now, obviously, red to red, black to black. Pretty simple. All right, so once you got your cables laid out, you're going to take your soldering iron. I'm using 400 degrees Celsius. And ever so slightly, go ahead and uh, solder together. Now, leave, a, leave your tips down below. Like, how do you guys solder? What are some tips? getting this shit perfect because I'm terrible at this shit but hey if I can do it I believe in you guys all right now after about five minutes I finally got it uh, like I said it's not the prettiest but hey it works it's soldered together it's not going anywhere so now you go ahead and slide your sh uh, heat shrink over it just like that and then you can use a heat gun um, or a lighter Whichever you have uh, should work. So I'm going to uh, I'm gonna use a lighter. Hopefully it doesn't melt the solder. We'll see. Just take it nice and easy. So let it, I let it cool down for a second because it's probably really hot. There we go. Now we'll go ahead and do this one. So guys, just like that, the project is done. Uh, make sure, you know, obviously black is black, red is the red. And then when you plug this inside your GoPro, uh, make sure that the red cable right here is on the right side. Um, let me see if I can show you guys, at least this one, I already made this one. So as you guys can see, red is on the right, plug it in that way and you're golden. And then, you know, figure out how you want to wrap this around. Now, this is a pretty long cable, um, but I've made like three of them so far. I haven't broken any yet, but um, I do. I did make extras because I'm pretty sure I'm going to break some in the future. So I'd rather have a few extra on hand than be like, oh, shit, I don't have a cable. You know? So, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh I'll leave all the things that you need for this little project in the uh, description. So check out the description. So yeah, everything will be linked in the description. I hope you guys like this video. Super short. Nothing, uh, not much to this one. But yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.